third for three. Stolen by Leonard. And pushed out of bounds, sending Kawhi Leonard back to the free throw line. Nice give and go right here from Brogdon, the alley. Ozzie Jacumpo with the oop here to bring the Bucks to within one. Four. Kawhi Leonard, one of the best free throw shooters. Two teams evenly matched the number one and two seed. The pace, don't rush. Get the shots that you want in the areas you do. The time is of the essence. Giannis double team. Bledsoe for three. Rebound to Saul. Milwaukee ball up by three. How about Kawhi Leonard? Six. A minute 20 to go in the game. Van Vliet in the corner. Shot clock down to two. Here's Leonard. And he draws the foul. And Andre Jacumbo is hurt. It looks like he may have tripped on. Oh, that ankle. Tweaked it just a little bit. That right ankle. He's now seven for seven. He's ripping at Middleton. Three knockdown, three point shooters. Leonard hits one of two. Coming up on one minute. In the fourth. Here is Middleton, and he scores. Leonard played by Blanton, who's an excellent defender. There's Kawhi on the turn. Comes up short. The Saul wrestles it free. And he is fouled by Lopez. I understand. I understand. After the Kubo is tired, and this is a shot clock violation, there's 34 seconds left in the game, man. Yeah. I... You're not that tired, and his ankle didn't look to be tweaked that much. You wonder why he's on the sideline at the most important time. It, it, it looked as if it touched the, the rim. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that hit absolutely the rim. hit the rim. It hit the rim. All right, Mark Davis, Tony Brothers, yes. yeah. over yes. at the uh, review. To see if it did touch the rim. And the push in the back there by Lopez sending Gasol to the free throw line where during the playoffs he is shooting 79%. And this is first appearance at the line tonight. Number four on Lopez. So One, down to a half minute. Brock had lost the dribble. And apparently... They're going to take a look at him. Looks like that's Toronto. They have to look at it. Yeah. On the floor, it's called Milwaukee's ball. Oh, it hits off Brogdon's right leg. It hits off Brogdon's right leg. I think this is going to be reversed. You may be right, C-Webb. So they're back at the review. Did it hit Siakam's foot, though? No, no, no. Yes, no. that's all Brogdon. Off his right, his, right, his right knee shin area. I believe this is going to be reversed. But the the call on the floor is Milwaukee's ball. Is there enough to overturn this? Yeah, the first play that we saw showed clearly that it was off of Brogdon's foot. I brought everybody out the way. I don't need a screen or anything. Hold that call, move everybody out the way, and go get the ball. And get it in. Van Vliet across midcourt. And a timeout called by the Raptors. So 23.4 to go in this fourth quarter. And a five-point lead for Toronto. Giannis looking to throw in. Middleton turns and shoots. And that's a bad three. At the line. And an excellent free throw shooter. 80% in the playoffs. It's a behind win by the Toronto Raptors. They're up here by seven final seconds. Bledsoe puts it home. Lowry will throw in. And the foul is given by uh, Bledsoe on Powell. At the top of the telecast, the web could the... 35 to 15 advantage. What a tremendous effort by Kawhi Leonard. 35 points, nine assists, 
seven rebounds. Fred Van Vliet on fire. And Toronto has taken a three games to two lead. They're one game away from going to the NBA Finals. Game six is back in Toronto Saturday night here on TNT starting East 30. Eastern time, the Bucks the first two games and making it six straight playoff wins have now lost three in a row for the very first time this season after looking so impressive against the Celtics and in the first two games against the Raptors. They've dropped three.